Welcome to the next lesson. And now we'll talk about Supermetrics API. So let's take a look at today's agenda. First of all, we'll cover what is Supermetrics API. Next, you will learn how you can transfer your data with the help of Supermetrics API. Then we'll take a look at different kinds of reports you can create using Supermetrics API. You will get step-by-step -step instructions, instructions on how to run your first query, and then we'll take a look at how to create the report in Tableau. Last but not least, we'll have another assignment. Go. Cool. First of all, what is Supermetrics API? Supermetrics API gives the users control over what data they feed into their BI tools, data warehouses, or other tools of choice. In practice, you'll get a query builder where you can choose which data you would like to export to a particular data destination. Hi, this is Talia from Supermetrics. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get started with the Supermetrics API to get your data to any data destination, whether it be your business intelligence tool, data warehouse, or database. Start out by going to our team management site at team.supermetrics.com and log in with your account credentials. Under Integrations, go to Query Manager. The Supermetrics Query Manager tool lets you easily construct queries to get data to any destination. Now you can start building your queries. Start by selecting your data source. In this example, we're going to use Google Ads. Depending on the data source, follow the login process and grant necessary access to Supermetrics. Continue to the next section to define what data you want to fetch. In this example, we're selecting a Google Ads account. Then, set the time frame. You can either choose from the list of dynamic date ranges or set custom start and end dates. Next, select your metrics. You can see a list of metrics similar to what you would see in the original data source. In this example, we'll select impressions and clicks. You can also split the data to rows or columns by different dimensions. For example, split your metrics by campaign. With filters and options, you can make further definitions to your query. Finally, click Run. You can now see a preview of your query's results and verify you're getting the data you're looking for. And that's it. You can now copy the query URL and start using it depending on your data destination, or export the data. For data destination-specific instructions, just follow the links in the description. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your marketing data sources straight to Power BI with the Supermetrics API. On the Supermetrics team management site, start out in the Query Manager by building your query. You can visit the link in the description for an example query tutorial. Next, you're going to run the query. You can check the data preview to confirm your query setup returns the data you're looking for. Then, Select Power BI from the Data Format options and copy the URL by clicking on the Copy button. Now, open Power BI. Under the Home tab, go to Get Data and select the Web option. Continue to select the basic setting and paste the query URL you copied from the Supermetrics Query Manager. Finally, select the table and click on Load. And that's it! You will now see your data in the table, and you can start visualizing the data that you have connected from your data source directly to Power BI with Supermetrics API. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your marketing data sources straight to Tableau with the Supermetrics API. On the Supermetrics team management site, start out in the Query Manager by building your query. You can visit the link in the description for an example query tutorial. Next, run the query. You can check the data preview to confirm your query setup returns the data you're looking for. Then, select Tableau from the Data Format options and copy the URL 
by clicking on the Copy button. Now, open Tableau. In the sidebars Connect to a Server section, find the Web Data Connector option. In the connector URL, fill in supermetrics.com backslash tools backslash Tableau. You can copy the URL in the description below. Next, paste the query URL you copied from the Supermetrics Query Manager and give the table a name to be used in Tableau. Finally, click on Get Data. That's it. Your data is now connected to Tableau through the Supermetrics API. You can now start analyzing the data and creating visualizations and interactive dashboards with Tableau. Let's answer the following question. Why should marketers use Supermetrics API? First of all, Supermetrics API helps build queries easily and quickly as it has a very intuitive UI, more or less similar to the add-on sidebar we could see in Google Sheets. You can connect your favorite BI tool and data warehouse with Supermetrics connectors, so you will get more data and the data is more granular. And also, you would be able to get over spreadsheets and start visualizing your data immediately, as spreadsheets often have raw limitations. Now, let's take a look at what kind of reports you can create using Supermetrics API. These are usually detailed reports with large data sets you can see in platforms like Click, Tableau, or Power BI. And these are reports that combine metrics from multiple data sources. A BI tool allows you to build complex reports easily and drill down into the data. So Supermetrics API is a great tool to help you build dashboards in like I mentioned, tools like Power BI or Tableau. And now let's take a look at the success of our clients again. This time we have Save the Children UK, which used Supermetrics API to save more than £10,000 a year. So Save the Children UK is a charity organization found in 1919 with more than 24,000 employees globally. With huge traffic volumes, global marketing campaigns to run, Save the Children UK has a lot of data to manage, report, and analyze. They were looking for a solution to get their metrics to Power BI and visualize them there. Using Supermetrics API, they fed the data into SQL and Power BI, doing all the ETL work and SQL Server where possible, reducing the risk of dirty data creeping into the data sets. And also Supermetrics saved Save the Children both time and money. Let's take a look at another use case, this time from the agency side. Let's answer the question how the global agency's data services team has improved their performance with Supermetrics and increased its dashboard output fold. Denso Norway is a subsidiary of Denso. They are a marketing agency found in 1989 with 35,000 employees worldwide. Denso Norway department realized they were spending 50 to 60 hours on getting the production-ready data from one data source API. During the first year of using Supermetrics API, the team was able to go from creating just a few complex dashboards to creating 30 to 60 complex and data-rich dashboards per year. Supermetrics has helped Dense Norway increase its revenue, and now the Norway team is seen as one of the leaders in terms of marketing reporting across the whole Denso agency network. And now let's take a look at today's assignment. Think which reports you'd like to build in BI tools. How far back would you like to look at the data? And what kind of analysis can you perform with large data sets? And as usual, once you've built a report in Power BI, Click, Tableau, or any other platform, feel free to share it with us for feedback and tips.